Professor Peter Yambrek, President of Nova University, Distinguished Ambassadors, uh, Director Dr. Matai Patel, Faculty of the Nova University, dear students, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, I'm really very pleased uh, that in the course of my first visit to Slovenia, uh, we have an opportunity to take this notable step of uh, inaugurating an India Studies Center uh, at the uh, Nova University in India. We do this at a time when uh, India is entering the 75th year of its independence. Uh, and, uh, you are you in Slovenia are marking 30 years of your independence. When we will be marking next year, when a lot of these understandings will, will be implemented, the 30th year of our diplomatic uh, relationship. So, in many ways, it is symbolic, but it's also a very practical manifestation of our relationship. Now, why is this important? I think it's important because, as uh, Dr. Yandrik reminded us when we came in, big things happen with small steps. This may be a small step. My visit here, the first by an Indian foreign minister, may be a small step. And there will be many other small steps before and after. But cumulatively, what we will do is really create uh, a different relationship, a bigger, more substantive relationship between India and Slovenia. And that relationship is important not only for its own sake, but also because uh, Slovenia is uh, today uh, uh, not just a member of the EU, but the current president uh, of the EU. So when we look at this relationship, Apart from its bilateral significance, we also place it in a much larger uh, European context. Now, uh, foreign policy is about building relationships and advancing interests. Uh, many of you are studying international relations or teaching international relations. Uh, some of us are practicing international relations. And it's very common for us to speak uh, about globalization as being one of the uh, fundamental realities of the world today. Now, globalization, we tend to think in terms of more trade flows, in terms of more travel, in terms of greater connectivity, uh, of uh, interdependence and interpenetration. But at the end of the day, globalization is about the mind. It is about knowledge, it is about our imagination, it is about our education. It is a willingness to understand and accept that what happens in some other part of the world can have a very direct bearing on our lives. What can happen in some other domain or discipline can affect or even determine the discipline that we are focused on. And my own visit, uh, quite apart from the uh, formal part of the foreign ministry program, was also to bring one aspect of globalization into thinking in Slovenia at the Bled Strategic Forum. Uh, I spoke uh, about uh, developments in the Indo-Pacific and the need for a rule-based uh, order there. And the fact that today in Slovenia people find it necessary, even important, uh, to consider developments in the Indo-Pacific really tells you how far uh, all of us uh, have come uh, in that uh, journey of globalization. So I have expectations uh, of this center. Uh, I know it is not easy to make it happen overnight, uh, but I do wish to assure the university uh, that uh, the Indian Council of uh, Cultural Relations with which we in the Department Ministry are so closely associated. Uh, we will be uh, very, very supportive of this. We see this as a, as a really uh, a shared enterprise in building our relationship. 
uh, I'm very confident as you know time progresses that uh, the goodwill today, the connect today that we are establishing will be reflected in terms of uh, the knowledge of students, the teaching of faculty, the uh, perhaps a better preparation for policy makers who, who look uh, at, at uh, India and uh, the Indo-Pacific. Uh, so I want to once again really compliment the university, compliment the ambassador and the embassy uh, for this initiative uh, and I'm um, uh, truly gratified uh, that this happened uh, during my visit. Uh, and I certainly look forward on a future occasion uh, to coming back and uh, seeing this translate itself uh, in terms of uh, uh, in terms of uh, academics and in terms of knowledge. Thank you once again.